Hey everyone, it's Nate. Today I'm gonna to share with you how to be an insurance agent, how to get your first customer, how to get leads for free. Yes, free. Find out that and more in this video. Let's get it. Welcome back everyone, my name is Nate and I'm here to help you master your money. So today we're talking about life insurance, one thing that I have done quite a bit of as a side hustle and had some pretty incredible results with. So today what I'm gonna be doing is going over the steps you need to take to start selling life insurance, whether it's full time, on the side, whatever that looks like for you. I'm gonna show you how to get set up doing this and how you can start generating leads to get customers for 100% free. It's gonna be incredible. This has not been shared anywhere else, so this is only information you can get right here on my channel. So please, if you would mind subscribing and liking the video and putting a comment down below of what your favorite color is, that would greatly help me out, help the algorithm out. And I just I just like to see all my new friends come to the channel. And um, oh yeah, I believe the term I'm looking for here is uh, part of the ship, part of the crew. Anyways, so with that said, let's get into the video. So to be a life insurance agent, you need to get licensed, but before you do that, you need to study for your license exam. I'm gonna link the proper materials you need to check out in the description below so you can get on those and start making money now. And so when you get your study materials for the life insurance exam, you can expect it to take about two weeks to be able to study fully all the material you need to know to be prepared to take the test for the license. And there is a little bit of an upfront cost for this and it's about $150, roughly depending on what company you go with for the service. But I would say 100%, it is absolutely needed and it was incredibly helpful for me. And on my first try, I passed the exam with using the service I'm gonna link below. I don't remember it off the top of my head, but I will find it, I'll put it down there so you guys can utilize that and start your own life insurance business. So that's step one. Step two is going to be to get licensed. This is going to involve passing the state test wherever you're at. And when I went ahead and did it, I went on my first try, I passed it, I believe I got a 94 on the exam. And when I did it, I believe I only needed an 80 to pass, so 94 was a pretty safe number. It's not a very hard test. Almost anyone can do it. Just study the material and you will be just fine. The test will only take you about an hour to complete and it'll cost you about $100 to do so. So once you have studied for your exam, passed the exam, now you get to actually get your license. And so depending on where you are, the state licensing fee can go from $50 to $400 depending on the state. For Texas, at the time that I did it, it was $100 to get started with this. And so at this point, your total investment would be about $350, and now you are able to start selling life insurance. Wait, no, you're not. You're not. You first have to actually get hired by a insurance brokerage. So there are thousands of brokerages out there that you could possibly work with, and they're not all built the same. I was very fortunate to come into contact with the people that I'm currently contracted with, and so essentially what they do is they help people that typically would not be able to get insured, and they get them insured. That is what they do, and that is a big part of their mission and their drive for going forward. And one thing to know about this is just because your company focuses on one thing or another, that does not necessarily mean you absolutely have to only sell the people that fit the demographic they typically focus on. And when you're looking for a good brokerage to get signed on with, a couple of things to look for are gonna be this. Having a mentor there that can help you get started, learn what to do, what not to do, and how to sell. Two, hopefully they'll provide good resources and training for you to be able to get up to speed on the industry and things you need to know. And three, and this is a big one here, you want to make sure you're able to earn at least 70% commission on your sales. Anything below that, and it can be really hard to make a decent profit, but a 70% commission rate and higher is gonna be ideally where you wanna be at. All right, so now that you're licensed and you found the company that you wanna work with, now it's time to find customers. And honestly, this is, in my opinion at least, the most challenging part of being a commission-only salesperson, and that is finding people to sell to. And so when I got started, the first people that I started selling policies to was friends, family, people that I knew, and from those first few experiences, I was able to learn a few key things that really helped me out. Starting by selling to friends and family is really incredible because 
One, you get to start out with talking to people that you already know, you're already comfortable with them, and it's a pretty low consequence environment. If you say something the wrong way or you misquote something, you can adjust, recalibrate, and keep moving forward. And two, this gives you an opportunity when you're starting out to learn the systems and technology involved with actually selling insurance, getting people a policy, and all the follow-up processes that go with that. So once you've exhausted friends and family, this is where you're going to want to branch out to people that you know, but you don't really know. So I'm talking like Facebook friends, people you have like haven't talked to since high school. Those are the best because they almost instantly like block you. Those are fun. And so at this step, you're more likely to get more no's unfortunately, but there's a very wide pool of people out there, so you will get a few yeses in the sea of no's. And so eventually you'll get to a point where you exhaust all of those people and they don't want insurance or they've already got insurance or whatever else. And so at this point, you need to start getting leads and using those. And so in case you don't know, a lead is essentially an informational packet about a potential client. And in this case, these people have expressed interest about life insurance or they need life insurance. And so some brokerages will actually provide these leads for free. Now, this is given typically that they will give you a significantly lower percentage commission rate. And I don't necessarily like that model, but that is an option out there. And alternatively, they can also charge you for the leads, but in turn, you're going to get a much higher commission rate. And just so you're aware, the price of a lead can vary pretty widely, starting at about $2 per lead up to $100. And that is dependent on several factors. So if you've heard all this so far and you're thinking, leads sound expensive, and, and I don't know if I want to do all of this. Well, good news, there's a few options for you. You can actually generate them on your own. One thing that I've seen been true with the highest producing insurance agents is that they do not buy leads from the company they work with. They are contracted with the company they're with, but they generate their own leads on the side. They have their own methods, they figure it out, they use those. So with that said, here's how you can create your very own leads. So there's two methods that I have tried that I've had some success with, and here they are. So the first one is gonna to be to run Facebook ads to gain leads. Facebook has a very robust ad system, and you can really simply put an ad up for life insurance on Facebook, have that ad lead to a Google form where you have them fill out their information, their name, their phone number, email, how much coverage they want. They send that to you, you get the lead in your email, and then you can go ahead and call them up or email them and talk to them about the life insurance that they want. And now to do this yourself, the price per lead will be anywhere from 10 to $30, somewhere in there. But the thing is, you can customize this any way you want to, to any area, because you can even set it to be your own zip code for where you're at. Or you can set it for those that have a significantly higher income so that you can go ahead and pursue people that will be able to afford more expensive policies. And so also in case you don't know, the more expensive a policy you sell, the more money you get on a commission. That should not be your motivation for anything. But if you exclusively want to work with higher net worth individuals, you can do that. And this is one way you can generate leads on your own. And if you get really good at the ads, you can potentially get this cost per lead down significantly. And I've seen people get them down as cheap as two to three dollars per lead. And these leads are as fresh as they possibly can be and they're focused and targeted to the people you work with. So in the event, you don't wanna pay for leads at all. You don't wanna pay Facebook ads. You don't wanna pay your company. You don't wanna pay anybody. And you just want free leads. Well, good news. I have figured out how to get 100% free life insurance leads, your little trick that I figured out all on my own. No one else has talked about this. This is information only available right here on this channel. So if you would so kindly smash the YouTube algorithm for the like button, I would greatly appreciate that. Thank you. But anyways, here is the trick to be able to generate life insurance leads for 100% free. Now to provide some background information about these, these are gonna be what's called mortgage protection leads. So typically when people get life insurance, they get it with the intention of covering any debts they have outstanding in the event they pass away and are unable to pay for them. And so one of the biggest debts that any person typically takes on is gonna be a mortgage. So when someone buys a house, this is actually an excellent time to try and sell life insurance to them because they have a massive debt they need to cover and they also probably haven't reevaluated their insurance needs since the purchase. So with this considered, I figured out how to create mortgage protection leads for free. This is what they're called. So what I have figured out is within a certain geographic area, how to pinpoint houses that have just been sold, find the owners of these homes, and then in combination of these two bits of information, create a lead. Now one thing with these leads, with the current system that I figured out, you cannot get a 
phone number for the people that live in these addresses. So you're gonna have to go knock on their doors to be able to pursue these leads. If you're not comfortable with that, I totally understand. And also with the pandemic currently happening, it can be uh, a little hairy doing that. So if you're not comfortable with that, don't worry about it. But if you are, this method can help you get some free leads and get some commissions coming in to help you build your insurance business. Okay, so now we're gonna switch over to my computer view and you can see here I'm pulling up Zillow. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to go to Zillow.com. So once you get to Zillow.com, you're gonna to wanna to go to the search bar and enter in the location in which you want your leads. Now you can do this by zip code, by town, by state, by county, however you wanna have that. Type that in there and then hit search. So once you search that, you're gonna to wanna to go to the toolbar and click the box that says for sale. Once you do that, you're gonna get a little drop down menu that's gonna give you the options for sale, for rent, and sold. And you're gonna to wanna to select sold. Once you do this, you're gonna to wanna to change the type of home to houses. And so what you're gonna to wanna to do next is go to the list view of these properties and then go to the top of that list and click the sort by drop down option and then choose to sort by newest. And so what this is gonna do is show you the homes that have been sold most recently in the area you're searching in. So once you have this, you can just pick an address at any of the homes here. I'm gonna select uh, this one here. And then once you get this, copy the address. Once you have this, you're gonna to wanna to go to the property tax, search for the county that this address is located in. And once you go there, you're going to want to go to the search bar and enter in the address you have copied down. So once you hit search, what's going to come up actually is going to be the house that you just entered in, the address, but you already knew that. But what's going to show up now is the name of the owner of the home. So now in combination between these two bits of information, between seeing a home that's recently been sold in your area and having the name of the homeowner, you now have a lead. In addition to this, you also have the sale price of the home. So in combination between these factors, you now have created a lead for completely free. So now once you have this, what you simply wanna do is it rinse and repeat, and you can create as many leads as you like. Now when you start this step, what I typically recommend is people find the houses that have been sold in the last month and start with those first. After that, most insurance companies have already tried marketing to these individuals. So if you catch them early enough, you might be able to be the first one there and make the sale. And so once you figure this out, you can rinse and repeat as many times as you like. And if you want to, you could even create your own lead generation business and sell these leads to another insurance agent and make a profit off this thing that you're generating 100% for free. That is it for me for today. I know that a good many of you have requested this video specifically. So here it is. Here you go, and here is how to be a life insurance agent, how to get started, and how to generate leads for 100% free. I'll see you guys next week with a new video, new stuff, with new bad jokes. Bye, guys.